start it. It's been long enough. There we go. All right, guys. Kevin with Louisiana Snake ID here, or LA Snake Boys with a Z on YouTube. We've got a cool treat for you today. We are in North Louisiana, Saline Parish, and we found a venomous Texas coral snake. This is a lifer for me. For anybody that doesn't know what that means, it basically it just means it's a, a species that I've never found before. I've been looking for them a couple times. I always keeping my eye out when I'm in the area where they exist, and we found one today, and this, this one is absolutely gorgeous. We tried to measure out as best we could. We think it's somewhere around 28 inches long. Um, these guys are absolutely gorgeous, even more pretty in person. Like I had no idea how beautiful this was until we saw it today. Um, it's not aggressive at all. They're actually quite shy. They like to live in the uh, like the leaf litter and stuff like that and, and, and go in there. Uh, this guy actually had eaten a rough earth snake um, and we it accidentally regurgitated it. We didn't know. Uh, mm -hmm. We weren't stressing it out, just kind of doing some photographs. While it was in the bucket, it, we found it... Uh, the uh, rough earth snake. So we are at a cool place here. It's in Saline Parish. It is Briarwood Nature Preserve. Travis, if you don't mind coming standing here just real quick. He is one of the curators here with his wife, Bailey. All right, guys, we are at a cool place. It's called Briarwood Nature Preserve. This is uh, in Saline, Louisiana, in Natchitoches Parish. And one of the curators, Travis, is here. He and his wife live on the, uh, the property. He's going to tell you just real quick a little bit more about this awesome place where we found this snake and many other cool species. Yeah, I'm, I'm Travis Brose. I live and work here on Briarwood Nature Preserve, and um, we've got a vast collection of plants and trees and flowers. Um, it's all old growth forest. Um, found a lot of uh, snakes here today, so <laughs> something new that we didn't know we had so much of. <laughs> but thanks to Kevin here, uh, found found a lot. Yeah, we had a, we did a little. A uh, weekend here trip. We wanted to kind of get together to like, push the place and kind of get people out here to try it out. Yeah. And it was been a really good Let weekend. Let people know about it. Um, and it's an amazing place. Like you said, it's, it's got 212 untouched acres of, of beautiful forest. Here, I'm, I'm not even in the plants you a little and bit the mushrooms. And there it. were so many mushrooms, different species. We were fascinated by that, taking pictures. And usually we're taking pictures of snakes, so we're taking pictures of mushrooms and plants. <laughs> yeah. Um, but this guy right <laughs> here, awesome. we found, not even looking at the time, we were uh, driving the cart to the back of the property and it was going across the road so we hurried up and caught it uh it's got a really cool pattern on the side there it's a little ring you can, can kind of see if you say where you are i'll kind of turn it oh, you can really um, see the iridescence yeah there. and they're very wow. iridescent like it's uh we get a gentle pressure on the snake i'm not actually hurting it or anything um they are venomous there's a neurotoxic venom um and they do have fixed fangs a lot of people think they have rear fangs that they have to chew on you um they actually have fixed fangs um <laughs> And like I said, they, they don't really want to bother me. He's trying to go through me. It's not coming at me, guys. It's trying to go underneath my boot uh, just to get somewhere else. Oh, it's just going to keep moving. I'm going to keep it in the sunlight just for a second. They do overheat, so I'm not trying to get it too hot. It's uh, afternoon sun, so it's not super yeah. hot right now. Um, but they're, uh, it's just trying to hide, and so we're trying <laughs> not to like stress her out. Uh, but yeah, this is there, uh, an can... absolutely gorgeous species. If you zoom in on some of the scales, you can see the coloration. It's got a lot of black in with the red, and that's a yeah, cool that's spot. Cool. It's right up by the hook is where that was. Um, see. There we go. That's a cool spot on the hook right there with that little ring. It's a little aberration in the pair, uh, a pattern. Oh. Um, the belly's really cool. I'm going to try to spin it around so you can see the belly real quick. It's hard to see. I'm all the way the wrong way. <laughs> um, Wait, where'd it go? There it is. There's the belly. You can kind of see it there. Uh, I'm trying to turn it the right way. <laughs> she wants to come up a little bit. I'm pretty sure it's a female. I'm not 100% sure. I'm not gonna about to sex the snake, uh, or this type of snake. But um, but you can see. Trying to get these. Yeah. There we go. So there's a lot of black in the scales there, guys, and that's where you run into issues with uh, people thinking uh, they get the rhyme wrong. The rhyme isn't always accurate. Sometimes these this red is so dark it looks black. Mm -hmm. Sometimes the yellow is so light it looks white. Sometimes the yellow is barely there, and it can end up getting somebody in in uh, quite a predicament. Right. Uh, there hasn't been a lot of deaths with these, but they do have a very toxic venom. Um, but they don't really want to do anything with people. Um, they are going to bail out. This first chance they get, this one was just trying to get away from us when we caught it. Um, kind of calmed down a little bit. We got some good photos. It's going to be going on our poster that we have coming soon. Mm -hmm. um, but this is an absolutely gorgeous snake. We're Again, we're on Facebook. We're Louisiana Snake ID. We do snake education, identifications. Um, and we like to do these little trips like this and got to get people out that have never seen snakes before. Mm -hmm. See some of the native species. Um, we were hoping to see a coral snake. I said, man, that'd be awesome if you see one. I didn't expect it. Yeah. 
because uh, they're not easy to find. And uh, but it, can you see the iridescence in the sun with this video? Oh, let me see. The I did right a by little the hook, bit, but I can see it now. The black by the hook is like unbelievably like it looks like a rainbow. Try to it really keep does. it super still. Really well, sometimes the video moving, I don't know if that would help or not. But meets the red. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The little belly pattern that's got that that's what that loop is coming out. I see it, like, it more cool. in the twists on the stick. You see it. So anyway, guys, we're gonna let this snake go. What we do when we're herping is we catch a snake, and if we can't photograph it where it is, we uh, we mark a pin in the exact spot where we saw it, the direction it's going, so this snake can be returned exactly where we found it. Mm -hmm. uh, we're not relocating it because it lives here, and this is uh there's no houses on the property. Um, so I'm hoping it just kind of chill there for a second. So like I said, it's gonna be let go right there to kind of do its thing. It had eaten a rough earth snake. That's kind of one of the things they eat. They will eat other snakes. Um, Ophi, Ophi. It's pretty cool. Yeah, <laughs> Jason here, knows, he knows it. I don't even know how to pronounce it, so I'll go with that way. But check out Briarwood. Follow us on Facebook. Follow yep. us on Instagram. Yep. Um, uh, uh, also, Louisiana Snake What's ID. Briarwood on Facebook? Briarwood What's is on name? Facebook. I think they're on Instagram yeah, they as well, right? Facebook, Instagram. And it's is it cool Briarwood Nature, Nature Preserve? Preserve. Nature Preserve. All Preserve. Th three words, okay. All three words, right. Look us up, Celine, Louisiana. We're Louisiana Snake ID. Um, this is an awesome find, guys. We're, we're so mm -hmm. excited about this snake. Um, we're gonna do a quick live video for our page. We do live videos on our page, uh, and then we'll uh, we'll kind of go from there, guys. I appreciate you watching, and uh, just check us out on Facebook. Thanks.